is trying to penny pinch. Follow certain cultures, become plenty rich. A lot of options, gotta find the busiest. Build a buzz, brand game, bringing through diligence. Never really had much growing up, but it's okay, okay? God has a plan for Toby Jose. Oh, late, oh, late, I can't stay. Depressed, fat, and broke, no way, no way. Head full of steam, bull, chasing a dream. Trying to look good, feel good, know what I mean? I want to be able to buy what I want stuff. When I want, take a month off to go hunt. If I what it do, YouTube fam? We're back at it again. Welcome back to Jimenez World SA. Um, it's actually Wednesday after, it's noon, it's around noon. Me and Grace are barely getting out the apartment. Um, had a couple of things to take care of this morning. But yeah, right now we're on the hunt for something to eat. As usual. As usual, we are always eating. <laughs> we haven't vlogged in a whole minute. Um, we haven't really been doing nothing much. Uh, we do apologize for that. Um, we have just basically just been, it's been working, busy and stuff like that. I know I have, and then my schedule just changed at work. So, you know, uh, some of the days that I get to vlog are now going to be different. So, well, yeah, we're going to get out and about, kind of trying to go further down in this, uh, downtown San Antonio, maybe do a little exploring, uh, shopping, you know. Do something. Yeah, so I'm gonna go on my um, on my Facebook and see like what events because I'm always trying to look for something going on just like just to check it out and get more familiar with what's going on around here. Look at them, they had a truck full of kids and they didn't they just ran the stop sign. So now that it's fall, it's October, there's like pumpkin patches, there's like market days, um, fall festivals, and you know, just the norm, And but it's always good. And uh, since I'm not familiar with what's going on around here, um, I've been looking at things to do, calendar events, and I know at Rotama Park, they're gonna, ha they're gonna have a pumpkin patch out there on the 11th, and then, um, what is it? Dia de los Muertos is coming, and San Antonio's trying to make it big down here, so I hope that happens. And they're supposed to bring the Selena statue back. All right, YouTube fam, we're back at it. Uh, we actually figured out where we're gonna eat. We're at a place called Lin's. Is it Asian or Chinese? Mm -hmm. We'll find out. I don't know. We're about to go check it out. Um, actually, they had a grand opening right around. Was it around the same time we moved? We mm -hmm. moved up here. Yeah, I had just opened in August. Yeah. They had a grand opening. We never been here, never checked it out. So we're actually trying, we're gonna go check it out right now and let y'all know how it is. And after that, we're gonna figure out what we're gonna get into after that. Probably gonna do some shopping, like I said earlier. Um, you know, some, spend some money, you know what I mean? That's what we do. And let me make it clear, that's if we don't get full and go home. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, here at Lynn's, trying to get y'all to see, it says International Buffet. It's got some. Yeah.
my plate. I got, of course, my sushi, but I always like to make sure it has like something stuffed. Uh, sesame chicken, uh, little rice noodles, and then this puffy thing. It's like marshmallowy, and then I have to pull this thing and then bite into it. And I don't know what that means. Uh, egg roll, and then like a crab. You know who would like this? Uncle Chris. They have oysters, um, fried yeah. fish. Look at Rick's plate. Like, I got like, a little bit. What is this? This bowl. It's a it's a crab. That's what they said. The Might ball? be a side crab. Oh. Deep fried crab, I think. Look at all that he's got. I got a little bit of everything: chicken nuggets, Pasta. popcorn, shrimp, uh, uh, stuffed uh, crab, burger chicken. Just a little bit of everything. This is only the first round, guys. They have uh, um, another part that has like it has, like brisket and sausage and pizza and um, something else I saw. Like, oh, like baked fish, um, like honey butter bread. They have ice cream cones. So lots and lots of food. Um, we'll let you know how it tastes. Though. Tell me a funny story about my first time eating crab. stuffed crab. So the first time Rick ate stuffed crab, he actually ate the shell, and it was really funny. You're supposed to dig it out, but he was chewing on the shell, and it was all crunchy, and it was just it was hilarious. Yeah, it was making me mad. I didn't know. I told the lady when she came over, I was like, "What is wrong with this? Why is it supposed to be crunchy like that?" And I was actually crunching on. I kept. I, was, I just felt something crunching. I was like, "I know it's not supposed to be like that." But you got the camera turned that way. Oh. So. <clears throat> so yeah, that was my first experience eating something like this. Now I know I'm, I'm, it's, it was a crab cake. Crab cake, yeah. wasn't it? Uh -huh. Yeah, it was crab cake. It was a crab cake. Now yeah. I know what I'm going to do like that. Yeah. I'm going to dig it out. It actually bit into something, but it, you couldn't see all this right here. It was all deep fried. The bottom of it was, it wasn't even stuffed. It was the bottom shell that was in it. And I picked it up and just bit into it. Man, it was just real crunchy, and that was my first time. Now I know how to do it, so. You good I'm, now. I, I, I told you I should've got an extra plate. Man, so, I got two plates. So I bit into this puffy thing. It's like marshmallow, and it's actually sweet. And so the inside looks like that. What is it? But it's actually good. It's like, it's like a Chinese empanada. So we're gonna get down, I'm hungry, and we'll let you know how it goes. And see our probably second, third plate. All right, YouTube fam, we're back at it. We uh, just finished eating. I'm super full. I have to say everything in there was good. I highly recommend if you come down to this area, if you're you know coming into town over here, check out Lens International Buffet. It is it's awesome. Um, what's your rating on it? I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna have to give them a five. I'm gonna have to agree. Five. I would definitely come back. Everything was fresh yes. and good. Mm -hmm. Everything was like not, like nothing was overcooked or or nope. too salty or, too or greasy. salty or greasy. No. Yeah, so that makes all the difference. And I haven't had Chinese in a while, um, just because I got burnt out in Temple because it was always like Dynasty, 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 and yeah. So this was a breath of fresh air, but like their stuffed crab is good like it's really it is. good yes it really is i wish i could have ate another one but you know i can't but uh yeah their sushi was good it was fresh the lady was making it fresh like they do at heb and so that's a big plus for me because I, I like to see what they're doing and you can see her right there um you know uh with all the gear the the plastic gloves her hair is pulled back and she's just going at it just making sushi so i liked it I did. I would definitely come back. I wish the girls like Chinese, but they don't, so they can't come here with us. So, um, let's open, I'm gonna open my beauty did. <laughs> what, yeah. does it, what does it say? A tub and rub will change our day. So I need to put you in the tub and rub you. I need you? a back rub. I need, I need a, a back rub. I need to clean your cola myself. Damn. No. <laughs> Nah, back rub would help though. Mine says executive ability is prominent in your makeup. Mm -hmm. Why well, I gotta make it where I can't understand what that <laughs> means? 
It says right. executive ability is prominent in your makeup. Oh. I don't know. I don't know what that means. Can I open the other one? I accidentally got three because um, I thought Rick told me to grab him one. So I grabbed two. Mm -hmm. And then he ended up grabbing his own. I love fortune cookies. They're so good. Okay, let me open this one. Just to read the fortune. Almost there. I'm trying to get crumbs all over the car. This says the same thing. No, oh, that's fine. No, it's yours. A tub and rub will change our day. Ah. So that means I get a tub and rub too? Let's just go in the tub and rub ourselves. <laughs> a tub and rub. It says learn Chinese. Football is Zukui. So Zukui Friday. Yep. So where are we going now? To the mall by our house. Our oh. place. Okay. What is it? Rolling Hills? North Hills? I don't know what it's called. Oh no. Anyway. So there's a train show at the New Brussels Convention Center October 26th through 27th. So if you like trains or you want to bring your kids to see trains, that's cool. We I don't know. I don't know if they're right here. Yeah, in a school. Yeah, so we're on the way to the mall, um, the one closest to where we live. Oh, so real quick, Lens is actually in, considered to be in Selma, off of 35, instead of um, like uh, Lens San Antonio, because there is a difference if you go to a different one. So this is a new one, and remember, it's Lens Chinese International Buffet in Selma, Selma, Texas. Right before you get the shirts. Yes. All right, face. <laughs> <laughs> GoPro, stop recording. Gotta find the busiest, build a buzz, brand game, freaking due diligence. Never really had much growing up, but it's okay, okay.